home bargains, home bargains. Everyone loves a bargain. Home bargains, home bargains. Everyone loves a bargain. This is Earth Radio. And now here's human music. Good morning. I'm taking you into our local home bargains this morning to see what new things they've got in there. I love a bargain. I love a bargain. Let's go grab some bargains. I love these solar lights for the fence. These are just little solar lights that clip on and they've got a bright white LED. They've obviously got them in copper and silver and they just look really nice at night. So we have these all along our fence in the garden. Bargain. These are really cute as well. These are like a disco light up um, light bulb. guys who've got little doggy woggies these tennis balls are a bargain they also have a really good range of dog toys in here and they're not you know much more than a couple of pounds we also buy these poo bags on a roll and these fit into our flexi lead we've got the actual poo bag holder which clips onto the lead so these are great so we just buy these and pop them in Welcome to the boudoir. 
So yesterday I didn't get a chance to show you guys what I actually bought in Home Bargain, so I thought I'd quickly film now and just show you what I've got. Some things I can't bring upstairs because one of them was a 40 litre bag of compost. So that's in the garden, but well, let's get on with the haul. How good is this bag? I only went in for one thing. Mm, famous last words, Andrea. I only went in for one thing. Now, that's like Primark, isn't it? You go in, just get a pair of socks, or I just needed some new knickers. Two big paper bags later, nearly £100. Most occasions, sorry sir. Let's get off the Primark talk and get back to the Home Bargains haul. Okay, so the first item I'm going to show you. Are you ready for this? <laughs> you know, are you excited guys? This pop-up laundry basket. This was, I think it's about 3 99 Yeah, 3 99 And I bought this, not for me, no. Not for Brody, no. For camping, oh yeah because the blue matches the tent and I'm all about matching. So, went straight in my basket. 3 99 um, This is gonna be used for our dirty washing when we're camping because we normally just throw dirty knickers, dirty socks in a carry bag and leave it in the corner of the tent. That doesn't please me. That does not please me. I mean, I'm a little bit OCD and I like things to have a little place. So, now our dirty underwear has a place. Staying on the theme of camping, I picked up these little bad boys, 45 pegs in a basket. Oh, a way up. Clothes pegs with a basket were 169. Well that's still a good price, still a good price. And they are also for camping because we've got one of those camping washing lines. So we're very professional as campers and we've now got pegs. 169. Next item I bought was this. Now, if you know, you know. If you know about this product, then you know how good this is. Now this was 89p, and it's not massive, but you only need a tiny little bit, and this bad boy removes stains from UPVC. Can you believe it? So any Really, really stubborn stains. A little bit on a microfiber cloth. Just, just sorts it out. 89p. Astonish. I mean, you will be astonished when you use this. Mark my words. And then the next item were these Pampers baby wipes. And I know what you're thinking. You haven't got a baby, Andrea. And I know that. But I've got a nine-year-old son who still gets food on his face, on his hands, on his top. So never, ever leave home without these bad boys. Two packs for £1.50. So they're a bargain. And I always set a pack of these camping because they're good, you know, if you need a little freshen up of the old armpits. Pumper's baby wipe. Okay, next. Hawaiian Tropic. And this is the Satin Protection Ultra Radiance Factor 30. And it's three star UVA UVB. Now, we went to Portugal in June, beginning of June, and I bought this on offer, um, I think, it, I can't remember where it was, but anyway, it was a lot more expensive. It's 3 99 for 180 mil. Now, this in Superdrug has been 10 pounds, and I've recently seen it in Asda for about eight pounds, and in Primark for 5 90. So, 3 pardon me. 3 is a really good price, and it smells gorgeous, it's like, do you want to smell? Smell it. Nice, isn't it? So that's coconutty. Um, yeah, and it just absorbs into your skin really nice so it's not greasy and then you can just go. And go. So yeah, get yourself some of this. Oh, and I also got another one in a factor 20. You know, that's obviously lower, but in this country on a normal hot day, sorry about the phone. In, an, in this country, in this country on a warmish but not too sunny day we can just put the factor 20 on and that's in a spray so i've got the two of those to take with us we're going camping in devon yes and i will be vlogging it so you'll see these there okay and the next 
items I bought were these cards. Now, I love home bargains for cards because they're really, really cheap. Really, really cheap, Andrea. No, they're just really cheap, but you have to say it twice. 59 pence, P, 59 P. This one was 59 P. And this is as teacher, you are totally awesome. You are totally awesome. So the teacher. And then it's my dad, which is obviously Brody and George's granddad. It's his birthday. And we've got um, little cheap cards for him. He's worth it. 29p and 59p. Don't say don't spend a lot on your dad. Um, and then, oh, I also got these. 20 grease proof paper sheets. Now these I thought would be really good in, we've got those little baskets that you put chips in. So I thought these would be quite cute just to put in the basket and then it just absorbs any grease off the chips. But also looks quite aesthetically pleasing to the barbecue area. Yes, made 69p. It's an absolute bargain. Oh, you're ready for this. You need to sit down if you're not, because this is exciting. Because you're a mum, you got a garden, you have to plant pots to make it look pretty, and I ain't getting mud up these nails. So yeah, I got these little bad boys. So they're like a rubbery garden glove, and they're quite pretty actually, the colour, I like that. So I can still look hot while potting my plants up, you know. Neville next door might be looking. Yeah, hey, check out Andrea in her gloves. Yeah, married Neville, stop it. Mm-hmm. Gloves. 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 These were 99p. Absolute bargain. I'm still recording. Just thought I'd have had a really horrible thought then and not press record. Imagine imagine that. Imagine that wasted energy. Just gone. But I'll carry on. Oh, then I got these. I'm such a sucker for a solar light. I don't know about you. If you're a sucker for a solar light, please comment below and let me know that I'm not. I'm not a saddo on my own because summer is all about solar lights and I thought look 12 LED lolly ices so they're little white LED lights in coloured little ice lollies so I thought when we go camping I can just put these on the windbreaks and they will look so cute and like holiday we're camping it's all gonna do is eat rubbish and lolly ices so yeah I will appreciate these and so all my fellow campers. Nick them and you're dead. Just saying. And then lastly, well I did get a few other bits, but in my bag, in this beautiful bag, I only went in for one thing, came out with 50. So this is the Vanish Gold Oxy Action 30 Second Stain Removal. Now, if you have kids, you know, you know what kind of stains they create. Now, my kids are grown up, pretty much. I mean, Brody's nine. George's 20. Um, yeah, but they still make stains. Brody more than Georgia, I'm not gonna lie. Mud, mud stains, knee slides, football stains. So this will come in handy, yeah. And that was 4 99 for this size, which is 940 grams. So that's really good price. And obviously that will last a long time because you only have, I think you just put one scoop. Oh yeah, so one scoop in on a stain or you can add one scoop to your Washing machines live longer with vanish. I also bought a metal garden, it's like a fox. That is for my dad's birthday because he is known, I don't even know why we call him fox, but granddad fox is what he's known as. So he even signs the cards to the kids like love granddad fox or foxy. So it's very inappropriate, my father. Yes, so he is known as the fox, the silver fox, the silver fox, that's why, because he's grey. So if you've got grey hair, people call you a silver fox, fox, so he's now granddad fox. So I bought him a lovely little fox ornament for his birthday in the garden, because he does like his garden, and I thought that would be quite cute. Not that we ever go and visit him, because he's never got any biscuits in. Yeah, so, it'll just be him looking at that fox, but hey-ho. Happy birthday. For one thing, but I spent what I also did buy um, that isn't in this bag was the 40 litre compost. I'm not going to carry that upstairs. 
There was also, oh, I got two um, little fuchsia bushes and they were one, no, three, and they were one, no, three, and they were 129. So they look cute in a pot. And, oh, and I bought a Desperado beer, I think, as well. And that was 2.79. I just thought it was a big bottle of Desperados for Si. Um, I also got some smoked, like wood chips that you put on the barbecue. When we have a barbecue next, obviously, I think it just meant to sprinkle them on the coals and it just gives a nice smoke, oaky kind of aroma to the barbecue. So they were 99p and you will see them, I think, in the video because if they were in my trolley, you can see them. And I also bought a dimpled uh, clear white pitcher jug, um, which is in the kitchen because I did use that yesterday. So yeah, that is great for just filling up with juice and ice because obviously this, you know, in this heat, you're drinking a lot more. So yeah, we got that and then yeah, the compost, the 40 litre compost was 199 and that is obviously a really good price for the size. That would just do like quite a few hanging baskets. And oh, my Parazone bleach, that's in the bathroom. Love that stuff. So that Parazone bleach is 750ml plus 33% extra. And that was 99p for bleach. Love bleach, love bleach. Love toilets, love cleaning toilets, I'm sad. Um, I admit it. So I hope you guys liked this haul. If you did, comment down below, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload. I'll be doing lots more videos. Probably Primark haul might be coming up and there'll be some family fun ones coming up as well soon. I will be vlogging our next camping trip. Obviously that won't be the tent set up. It will just be more on site and obviously what we do as a family. So. Make sure you check that out and yeah, so thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!